good morning dear children how are you all i hope you all are keeping well today we are on the second paragraph page number 56 from our railway carriage here is a child who clumbers and scrambles all by himself and gathering brambles here is a tram who stands and gazes and there is a green for string the daisies now in this lines the scrambles means to move quickly scramble means to move quickly now here is a child who climbs 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 and again comes down and again falls again climbs up again falls so he tries to walk by himself he tries to climb the hill can you see there in the picture you can see but he goes he is trying and crying trying and he gets up again again walks so like that in the picture you can see now your scrambles once more i am telling you scrambles means to move quickly one place to another very fast scramble the child is also goes up comes down and moves to another place the and is trying to the child does everything by himself he doesn't wait anybody's supports now one more word is there brambles brambles means there the plants which are having thorns on that some flower will grow and these flowers are purple color so the child collects all these brambles means these flowers he collects now here is a tram tram means the meaning of tram is i'll tell you listen to it that a tram is a person who walks from place to one place to another place and often trying to beg like a beggar goes to one place to another and he trying to beg that is the meaning of that tramps understood now what happens here he looks here and there ah he doesn't stand in one place he goes here and there and looks here and there now there is a green field and in that field some daisies grow and ah, they those grown daisies are tied in a uh, thread like a chain that is what the poet try to say when you see outside from the train all that you are able to weave out understood now next paragraph here is a cart run away in the road lumping along with the man and load and there is a hill and there a river each a glimpse and gone for forever now here is a very soft road means like kacha road type one cart goes on that road it must be up and down may not be uh, what is that called very hard or rough nothing this may not be some uh, grass road it is so in that so many ditches are there so many holes are there you have seen when the road spoils how the roads um, look like so it is very difficult the cart to go in that it was running on that road and the things are filled with that cart can you see the bulla cart is going the things are filled in that bulla cart and is difficult to move it is going that side this side going that side this side so it is moving like that then here then after that and there is a mill and there is a mill like a factory type maybe there is a mill far away can you see somewhere you can sketch out then and also there is a river ha ah, just um, far away the river also is there some boats you can see isn't it 
so some birds are flying there so all these uh, what you have seen from the train uh, while you travel all this just a glimpse means just a second it comes and goes this is the way the poet experienced everything uh, in a um, words he puts together and makes one poem and uh, um, makes us to recite understood now uh, this is the poem you have to recite every day written by robert louis stevenson these two paragraphs i explained today and two paragraphs i explained um, previous day so you have to go through this paragraphs very nice and simple poem it is all about the from a railway carriage and uh, what the poet experienced exactly puts together and makes us and helping us to read this is what thank you and god bless you see the video